Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I've actually never bought Taco Bell for myself, Oops, ever. Um, the only thing I've ever had from them is a normal like soft taco and a hard taco and that's it. So we're gonna try some new things today. If you haven't seen my videos in a while, it's because YouTube took down another one of my videos and gave me another strike. Um, if you watched that video, it was probably, it was eight minutes long and it was probably six minutes of disclaimers and two minutes of content. So I'm honestly kind of shocked. I'm trying to dispute it with them right now, but that's never gotten me anywhere before. So we'll see what happens in the future. <laughs> Probably won't be on YouTube for much longer, but whatever. Let's try these nachos. Let's be in a good mood because I'm really excited to eat. I'm starving. So I've never had these before, like I said. These are the Supreme nachos with sour cream, tomato. It's just french fries. Oh my God. Whoa, that is way better than I thought it was going to be. Wow. That is good. I'm honestly shocked right now. Wow, I wish I had extra sour cream though. I'm having a hard time. Wow, that's amazing. Mmm, I'm shocked. Wow. So I'm gonna tell you something that happened this morning that honestly kind of blew my mind. And I wanna hear some of y'all's opinions about it. It's actually kind of insane. Like, I can't believe I'm actually gonna have this conversation, period but we are so i don't know what this is actually it looks like a cross between a flour and a hard tortilla it has beef bean sour cream cheese it's like i don't know what this is mm. oh god i need a hot sauce though oh and they gave me this diablo let's try just a tiny she said it's really strong, so I'm only put a tiny bit on there. I don't taste any. Maybe she's sensitive. We'll put some extra on there and see. Okay, so this morning, I don't know if I've said this before, but I'm in a gore group on Facebook. I mean, that's definitely spicy, but it's not horrible. Um, anyway, there's actually a really big, like, this person has over 600,000 subscribers. She's in the group, too. She's a bitch. I don't like her. But I won't say who she is. Anyway, I'm only in the group because my husband's very interested in, like, he's on, like, a medical hub group. Anything that has to deal with gore. I hate gore. I don't even like to watch fake gore in movies. Like, it's just not my thing. This is really good. <laughs> it makes me uncomfortable. I just don't like it. So, you know on Facebook, like, you're scrolling through and if something pops up that's, like, sensitive, it'll have, like, a screen you hit undo to see it. I never hit the undo. It's not interesting to me. I'm not curious. I'm not interested. Um, obviously, I've been curious when I first was exposed to it, and I would click it and see it, and I couldn't watch it. I could not sit through it. I don't care if it's an animal, if it's an adult. Definitely not a child. Can't watch. If it's anything gory, I can't watch. And it has every type of gore you could think of on there. So, I think it's just a regular taco. Let's put some hot sauce on it, though. Not Diablo. Diablo's not horrible, but it's... I don't really care for that taste, honestly. Um, so the point is that mm. this is how I remember it. It's great. A lot of Facebook groups will have um so a lot of Facebook groups will have like a uh, a chat that goes along with it. You can join it through the group. 
Sorry, my son came in here. His dad's with him. He's fine. Let's try this right here. Is it just bean? It's good. Mm. Okay, so let me get to the point. Sorry. Someone was um, messaging in the group and asked, how do you like get rid of a body? Like um, what kind of acid would completely dissolve bone? And everyone in this group is messaging back with advice, how to do it. And then she was like, I can't remember exactly what the next part was, but she started asking questions about like, like if you were to um, kill someone, like how would you do it? How would you get rid of the body? And all these people are talking about how like they would use a hydraulic machine, like a press and press all of the teeth and like dispose the teeth in like a big body of water like in the middle of the water and that bodies go away the easiest if they're above ground not underground like if you bury it it's gross stuff sorry i'm eating but whatever and they're all just sitting there talking about this like it's nothing <clears throat> like oh yeah if I'm going to kill someone, this time I'm going to do it. This time I'm going to get rid of the body. And one guy, he said he disposed of something. He would not say whether it was an animal or human. And it was just creepy. And I was telling my husband about it. And the leader of the group will sometimes share like statistics with everyone. Like the statistics on how many people in the group are male or female. How many people in the group are likely to kill or have killed. And there's just no way that not one person out of the like 40,000 people that are in this group hasn't murdered someone. Obviously someone has because I'm sure there's people in the military who have killed people with permission to, you know. So that's one thing. But I'm talking about like real murder. And I don't know what to do because honestly, I put such a bad feeling in my stomach, I wanted to call the cops. You're not supposed to like talk about what happens in the group, but I didn't say what the group was, so. Sue me. Seriously, I actually wouldn't do any illegal things to come sue me for talking about something. That would be funny. I have nothing for you to take. <laughs> I mean, what do y'all think? What would you do? I feel like there will be like three different type of people in the comments. People who won't agree with it, but obviously aren't going to rat someone out. People who would rat someone out. And people who don't care. <coughs> okay, my son is over hanging out hey. with his father. Hey. Hi, baby. You want a bite? 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 Here. No, that's hot. Here, try this. Bite? Look. Jeez. Stop moving things. Get down if you want to get down. Stop. You want a bite? Here, bite. Bite. Yeah, cheese. Mm, so good. Well, that's all I'll say about that. I got the cheese one. Peppa. I'm Peppa. You want to watch Peppa? I asked my husband to watch my son so I could film just for 20 minutes at the most, and he always ends up in here. He would think when I take care of him 24-7, he would help me for 20 minutes, but no. Mm. I'm getting full, and apparently my son needs me, which is totally fine. He comes first before food and before mukbangs. But I appreciate you guys watching. Mm. Really curious to hear your opinion. I have the screenshots of all the messages. And I will totally report it because it's creepy. It's not normal. Or maybe I'm not. Do you like this kind of stuff too? Is this normal? It just doesn't feel like normal behavior to me. 
It doesn't feel like something that normal people do. Leave it in the comments if you've ever um, looked at anything like that, if you enjoy that kind of thing, if you think I'm weird for thinking it's weird. Maybe everybody does that, but not me. What are you doing, baby? Mm. One bite? Yeah. You just want love? Can I have a kiss? Give me a kiss. Kiss? Mm. You don't want love? You want to be mean. The sour creaminess? Is, look at that. Mm. He just gave me the cutest kiss. Will you do it again? Can I have a kiss? Give mommy a kiss. Will, give mommy a kiss. No. We're about to go. You want nappers? Nap time? All right, I'm full. Thank you guys for watching. I tried one of those cinnamon twists and I did not like them. I did not like it, so I'll give it to them. Um, but I feel like saying something doesn't taste good in the middle of your mukbang is really annoying. I hate when other people do that. You're fine. We're about to go. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. My son is totally fine, so please don't leave me comments about how I'm ignoring him. Let me tell you, my entire universe is about him. Um, and I appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Who knows when that will be? Who knows if my channel's gonna get taken down? We shall see. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.